Hey guys, so this is a super important question, especially in relation to all of my flexi making, because you have to be able to cut out those shapes to get that movement in between your different links. So I cover this in one of my Nomad Basics tutorial videos where that includes a few other things. It's a longer video, but this is a super simple action. So I'm just gonna show you all how to do this real quick and it'll be super helpful. Okay, so say you got these two circles and you wanna cut out a cavity for this smaller one. This is not really a shape that you'd use with a flexi, but this is just gonna be an example. So what I do is I'll grab my smaller shape. I will clone that. I like to lower the blending opacity like this so then I can see it. And then I grab this orange circle and I'm gonna expand that. And then you can kind of see the shadow of this other shape that I have expanded, right? So then I'm going to hide that, which means you're gonna see these little lines if it's still selected, but it's hidden. That's what we wanna see. Then I'm going to select our larger circle that I'm gonna cut this shape out of. And then we're gonna go up here to Boolean. You're gonna do voxel merge. You can also just do Boolean, but sometimes that creates too many triangles. So I like to voxel merge it, which remasters it all together. Voxel merge, boom. And then see we have this perfect size cavity for this little ball to sit in. And we can look at the lower of the opacity so we can see the cavity in there clearly. So that's how you do those cavities, super easy, and hopefully that helps.